it's the home opener for the Storm. Nothing new for nine-time All-Star Sue Bird, who began her career in Seattle in 2002. It's her first. It's a different story for Brianna Stewart. Just a WNBA rookie, she will be playing in her first Olympics. You know, playing on the Olympics, being a part of that national team with Sue, with all the other vets, the people who are going for their fourth gold medal, it's a huge honor. The United States with six golds. This will be Bird's fourth Olympic Games. She is one of just nine women to win an NCAA championship, a WNBA championship, and an Olympic gold medal. And to be able to have USA on your chest and, and know what that represents, um, what that means. I mean, to be selected as one of the top 12 in the entire country is, is pretty insane in a lot of ways. So it's, it's exciting and I'm looking forward to it. Bird is also excited to share the experience with her 21-year-old teammate. It's going to be incredible. It's all going to be new. She's someone that I know that I can, can go to if I have questions. Walking in for the first time, hearing them announce the United States, and like the crowd goes insane. I mean, the roar is just, you can feel it. I mean, it's, it's, it's intense. It's something you just can't practice for. They're not easy games. They are not easy games. And people should know, we don't get the training time. So Bird wanted to make the most of this interview and help Stewart get a taste of Olympic competition at the same time. You ready for a game of horse? Born ready. You're going down, Stuart Bird. To there. Chinatown. <laughs> <laughs> this epic game of horse is about to go down. Since we're in the same outfit, we're going to be one team. Okay. Taking on you, Chris. Storm taking on the home team. Here we go, game of horse. All the trick shots. Oh! Despite a lucky shot, oh. The storm, have a letter. This day would belong to the Yukon grads. H.O. It was over before it even started. Oh, come on. And to pour salt the wound, Bird and Stewart even proved to be better at rock, paper, and scissors. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot, see? And when these two shoot, they usually make it. Oh, God! He was breathing he hard. He was breathing hard. They won six NCAA titles between them at Yukon, and now even have a horse title to brag about. Good game. Looks like it went down. These are too good. Better luck next time. You look like you're on Mike Tyson's punch out right now. <laughs> <laughs> In Seattle, Chris Egan, King 5 Sports. Chinatown and Mike Tyson's punch out. I don't think we can get any better, right?